Hi, I'm Robin Went, president at Portray Properties, and I'm very excited about getting this new listing. It's a five bedroom, four bath, 4,000 square foot home on the Mitchell River with over a mile and a quarter of prime river frontage. It also has 100 acres, over three miles of trails on the property, and it adjoins a 1,700 acre property owned by the state. Well, I'd say that the river is really a central part of the property, and it was the thing that uh, I think really sold us on buying the property originally. Yeah, when the kids were growing up, whenever their, kid, their friends would come over, it was like a, a day at, at summer camp because we'd go down to the river and they could go tubing and kayaking and swimming and fishing and look yeah. for crayfish and just yeah. all kinds of stuff that most kids don't have access to. And by the, by the end of the day, when it was time for the kids to go to bed, they were ready to go to bed. We had <laughs> yeah. friends that lived in the city and they couldn't get their kids to go to, go to bed at night. Our kids were worn out and ready to go to bed. So. I worked a lot with the Soil and Water District and they've told me that one of the fields is, uh, would be very uh, suitable for a truffle farm. Our property adjoins a truffle farm and vineyard on one side, and on the other side is a uh, vineyard. So the property itself would be uh, amenable to a uh, small vineyard if someone wanted to do that. The property is about half agricultural, or half pasture, and about half woods, and uh, so it makes for a nice mix. In particular with my daughter and horseback riding. My daughter really became a horse person when she was about seven or, seven or eight and started riding. We have a uh, uh, three bay horse barn that we put up for her and uh, we would go out and ride on our property which has about two to three miles of trails but it also adjoins the wildlife resources property that has about another 10 miles of trails. And we would, my daughter and I would go up there and ride for hours and we wouldn't see a soul. It was kind of like almost having your own private park and uh, we'd see deer and turkey and occasional uh, coyote. Thanks for watching. If you've enjoyed this tour and you'd like a showing, you can contact me with my email and phone number to the left.